All right, and we're online. What's up, everyone? It's been like, what, two weeks since the last stream? Wasn't able to stream last Sunday, but we did a lot in Pokemon Crystal. Good to see you in the uh, chat orbit. So let's go ahead and get this show on the road. <clears throat> All right. Decided uh, I'm going to keep using the analog pocket just because I like how clean it looks. I know it's not original hardware. It's a PGA emulation, but man, does it look good. Right, so I'm going to be playing some Pokemon Crystal, as you can see there. Went ahead and reset the clock in game also so that we're uh, going to be walking around in the daytime. We gotta figure out what we're doing tonight in game. Right, so it should be a 12 hour shift from what it currently is for me. So it's a Sunday morning, 9.17 a.m. It is actually 9.17 p.m. for me. What's my team looking like right now. As you can see, I got everyone up to 35. So we're doing pretty okay. And you know I'm a nutcase. So if we, uh, I'd like to go into our PC box over here. As you can see, I uh, got the whole squad level 35, except for this giraffe rig. I traded this over earlier today because uh, apparently I can't get giraffe rig and crystal. So we have a giraffe rig now. Gotta eventually hatch that egg. I have no idea what it is. You can see every Pokemon pretty much that I've caught is 35, with the exception of some that I'm concerned with, like this Poliwag. Don't know if I want a Politoad or a Poliwrath. I could always trade my Poliwrath over from yellow. I might go with a Politoad. But yeah, unless I have a branching evolution, or unless I have no idea if it's better off to evolve them, like Sunkern over here. Uh, Slowpoke, I got Slowking and Slowbro, so I gotta watch out for that. And of course I got Bioplume and potentially Blossom. Dogapi evolved. Decided to do that off stream. Still doesn't know any good moves, but uh, it evolved. But yeah, you guys can see everything should be about level 35. So... Who do I have on the team right now? No one of use. But I have a feeling that the next thing we're gonna be doing... Oh, let me make sure. On box four? No, you're supposed to be on box three. Let's go ahead and move some Pokemon. Your 3DS is entirely Slowpoke themed? Nice. You should know, sir. Oh! What? I just realized everybody's got Poke Rust. I don't know for how long, but everybody's got Poke Rust apparently. Who the hell did I catch a Poke? Oh my god. Is it because of the Giraffe Rig? Giraffe Rig's the only thing I've caught recently. Oh my god, the Giraffe Rig just give everybody in my box? No, Giraffe Rig's fine. How did these guys get Poke Rust? I had to have fought something, right, that had Poke Rust? And the whole sc oh my god, does that mean that every Pokemon I have is gonna have Poke Rust now? That was like leveling up like no oh my god, every Pokemon has got. Oh, coughing, you survived! You didn't get Poke Rust. Not like Poke Rust is bad, I just wish I knew that they had Poke Rust. How come your main team isn't evolved? Because I'd like for them to learn all of their useful moves before I get them anywhere near 50 for Stadium 2. I really don't want to go through the headache of rehatching a bunch of Pokemon. So once I get inch closer and closer to 50, then I'll start breeding for the baby challenge in uh, Stadium 2. 
And once I have a team of 50, then I can start doing Gym Leader Castle and some of the other stuff. Yeah, that's why pretty much everyone you see is, like, unevolved. If they could evolve, they're unevolved. Oh, I made a whoops. I was going to put the star you. Star you actually no surf, because I don't know if I want to teach surf to, uh, photo dial. For alligator is not going to be very good in this game. Simply because if we look at its stats, it's got a higher attack stat than it does special attack. So, although I'm a big Totodile fan, realistically, not so good. Uh, let's move Cyndaquil out for now. I'm gonna put you all the way down there. Let's go ahead and grab Staryu. I need someone who can surf for now. Because we've got an angry Gyarados to deal with. Do, 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 do. If I remember correctly, eventually something's gonna happen here. Slowpoke tails, tiny mushroom. I kind of want to buy the slowpoke tail just because so I can have it in storage. Not that I'm ever gonna do anything with it, but uh, I think this guy gives us the rage candy bar. so I can have unique items. I like to have at least one of every unique item. If I ever need any more, I can always put them on a Pokemon and trade them over from gold or silver. Which, I took the time to go ahead and catch up, essentially. So they are caught up to uh, where I am in uh, Crystal. Do, 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 do. Let's ride our bike. I don't wanna walk. Wait, I'm pretty confident I don't have to walk all this. I can fly to the Lake of Rage, I'm pretty sure. I like how it looks like it's sitting on my head. Pretty sure I'm supposed to catch that Gyarados. That's gonna be a gold Gyarados. Giyasha! Slash does. Not too concerned with catching perfect IVs on this one, just because uh, its stats are gonna be pretty static. It's, since it's shiny, that means everything's gonna be 10, except for like, I think, attack. This, uh... Calculator up and running. I 
expected not to be able to catch it. Whoa! Calm down there, Billy. Oh boy, it's gonna keep thrashing too. Oh, there goes Murray. Don't star you. Wow, not even one single shake, really? I could have taken one shake. Come on, game. Off early. A Pokemon that back then it's just like, oh look, it looks neat. It's not even. Oh, now he's confused. And he's gonna hurt himself in his confusion. I would really appreciate it if you stayed in the Great Ball. Guess not. He's gonna do 40 damage, I think. Convenient. Oh boy. Please stay in the ball. Of course not. Back to thrashing again. Hey, finally! Only took a million. We obtained the red scale. Oh, and there's Lance. This league is full of Gyarados, but nothing else, so the Magikarp are being forced to evolve. Did you come here because of the rumors? You're Lee. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumors, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, Lee. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Yes. Excellent. It seems that the lake's magic carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is the cause. I'll be waiting for you, Lee. <laughs> I'll let him practice social distance. Oh boy. Oh, let's see what it's gonna be. I know for sure it's gonna have like. 10 IVs for, uh, for a bunch of its stuff. So let's see. 59 speed. 71 special defense. 47 special attack. 58 defense. HP is... Actually, I don't know what the HP is. 97. And its attack is 88, so... Go! See... Because it's shiny, I called it. It's like 10, 10, 10. For all of the stuff, HP is dependent on everything else. 
So if the attack does not end on an odd number IV, then its HP is also going to tank. So this one is 10, 10, 10 for everything, and it's got 14 IVs into attack, which you would think is great, but that ensures that that means its HP is going to be like nothing. <laughs> it's like zero to HP. I think attack gives like eight IVs if it's an odd number and then it's four and then two and one. Eight, four, two, one, I think is how it goes. So, ugh, this is bad. I would, if it was 13, kind of could have been feasible, but holy smokes. Here we go. I should really... I mean, I do have a, a backup of this save file in case anything happens, like the battery dies or whatever. But, oh my god. That... Uh, that was bad. That was just enough to get it into the red. Everything's always gonna be 10. That's the thing to remember. But it's thrashing, so maybe I shouldn't get it down to the red. Does that potentially end this? Yup, there it goes. Glad that I got the red scale. I don't care for the red scale. So, what an enigma of a Pokemon to catch. This Gyarados. Every time I slash, it's always going to be the same amount, unless it's a crit. I'm gonna leave it there. And we'll swap over to Mareep. Could also go for uh, Gasly. Those bites, though, will take Gasly out for good, though. This is a total doll household. It really is. I would really appreciate it if you stayed in the ball. Come on. Of course not. Don't worry. Second second great ball is the, the charm, right? Nope. Nope, it was not. Also, I just realized that this might be off for a bit. Let me make sure I do this to uh, resync it. I forgot I had this started up on the wrong monitor. And I know that it likes to get all wacky whenever anything changes. Oh, well, hey, that worked. I don't know if the, the, the audio was actually desynced, but... I always assume that if I change monitors, that's going to be potentially desynced. You can wait, Lance. We're gonna go check IVs. I won't have to do all that dialogue with you. Do 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 Uh oh. I think these are the exact same stats. Oh my god, it's the exact same stats. Like, nothing changed. Is it always gonna be the same no matter what? 
I mean, I know the dose 10 are going to be the same, but his attack always going to be at 14, so its HP is always going to be trapped. Oh, let me look this up. Because the chances of that are wild if that's the case. Probably shouldn't put gold Gyarados. That's what we called it when I was a kid. I guess technically it's supposed to be red Gyarados. on stats this Gyarados has predetermined IVs with an attack Pokemon gold silver crystal hard gold soul silver the red Gyarados found like a rage blah 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 in gold silver crystal this Gyarados has predetermined IVs with an attack IV of 14 and IVs in its other stats of 10 resulting in an HP IV of 0 while battling the red Gyarados the player uses roar world and the teleport the moves will fail every time once captured or defeated, the Red Gyarados drops a red scale. While this is the only chance to catch a Red Gyarados in the original games, it will respawn in the remakes after the player defeats Lance with the Elite Four, should the fa player fail to capture it. Alright, so... No matter what I do, it's always gonna have HP IV 0 and attack 14, according to uh, good old Bulbapedia. So, uh, good thing I decided to check this early on, because I do not want to be uh, resetting a million times over. So yeah, this Gyarados is just, it is what it is. My, my Gyarados is going to be better. Oh yeah, that's one thing, Or, but I've been evolving Pokemon that will not learn moves unless they evolve. Those Pokemon I am evolving. So like for instance, I did evolve the Caterpie line because otherwise it's kind of worthless. Gyarados are angry. It's a bad omen. Did my eyes deceive me? I saw a red Gyarados in the lake, but I thought Gyarados were usually blue. Alright, we're gonna to skip past this dialogue because we've already... Imagine never having played Gen 1 and you run into this guy like, man, you look kind of neat. And finding out he used to be an Elite Four League uh, member and now he's the current champion. Alright, Pidgey flies back to Mahogany Town. Let's heal up our Pokemon because I'm sure poor Totodile got battered up pretty bad there. sure he's beating the snot out of these guys I'm not gonna see him anywhere else around here does anyone say are you off to see the Gyarados rampaging at the lake and this guy's blocking off the gym so he can't be in there he came this far take the time to do some sightseeing do 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 you are gonna block me off and try to sell me rage candy bars Nope, I don't want to buy any. This is just a regular house. My favorite radio program, I'd say Pokemon music. So does that mean that... Oh wait, does that mean that if I had to listen? If I'm at the Lake of Rage, would the radio broadcast be different? Was that the hint? Can you imagine if you have a Magikarp with you, and you play that, and then it just evolves? That would be wild. 
Alright, so apparently they're playing something that's messing with Pokemon here. Lucky channel. I'm guessing this is the uh Everything else will play normally, I guess. It remembers the last channel I was on. Let's leave it on uh, a Pokedex show then. Pokemon. Pidgey. Poor tiny little Pidgey. Carrying all of this. Please and thank you. I'm so sorry. Will it play weird stuff while we're here in town then? Pittsburgh Penguin Fan 24, thanks for the follow. I'm gonna play the weird track here too. So if I recall, at least from my playthrough of Gold version when I was a kid, once I go in here, he's gonna be messing up people in here. Oh, yep. Yeah. Dragonite Hyper Beam! You're using Hyper Beam on people, dude. Calm down. What took you, Lee? I was messing around with the radio. I was checking out the stats of that Gyarados. You know, standard uh, Pokemon player stuff. Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. The stairs are right here. Lee, we should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Arg, you found the secret stairway. Erg. That guy's dragon Pokemon are tough. Do, do, do. What's, what is this? Oh, it's an incense burner. Is this a Persian? Oh. Hey, intruder alert! Alright, Rocket Grunt. You want a battle? Let's go. Go Totodile. Bite the heck out of that psychic type. I'll just go ahead and slash that. I feel like slash is stronger than my water gun right now. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Dang, I failed! 760 and somewhat sent home to mom. I haven't evolved any of the Pokemon I caught just because I want them to uh, learn all of their skills first. If you don't evolve them, they'll learn it a little faster. Then once they learn whatever skills I need them to learn, then I'll start going nuts and evolving tons of Pokemon. <laughs> it's my turn. There's no escape. He's also got two Pokemon. Another Zubat. Oh wait, I don't need Staryu right now. I should probably bring Cyndaquil back in. Grimer. I don't even know if they can deal with Grimer. Not really. But uh, Ghastly can have some fun right now. Need to try and snag up as many uh, useful TMs as I can. We're ever gonna beat through Stadium 2. I have to have all the right moves and all the right Pokemon. Way to go, Ghastly. Radata. Radata can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with its rival, Pidgey. So, Route 1 battle. It is not a fair fight. <laughs> 
is your piggy in the top 1% of piggies? I, I figured you meant Pidgey. Can you imagine if I had a Spoink, that would have been perfect. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Surveillance cams are in the Pokemon statues. We'll keep appearing until you trip a secret switch. Wait, what? Really? So if I walk out and I walk back in, does that mean I can just perpetually fight you guys? I'm okay with that to an extent. I mean, you don't give goody XP yet, but I'd be okay with that. I don't mind smacking you guys around and getting some money. You can bring a Meowth and start using Payday. First time playing Crystal. When I was a kid, I played through Gold and Silver. I'd like to make my way through uh, all of the Pokemon games and their side games, since I never ever actually quote unquote beat them properly in the sense of uh, I don't need to put you all the way at the bottom. Since I just kind of like played through it and never bothered to actually quote unquote catch them all. So I'm trying to catch them all and beat through all of the side games that I never beat as a kid because I was too dumb. Oh, backseat gaming's uh, fine with me. Hey, you lied, Rocket Grunt. You said that there would be uh, tripping wires over here. Oh, oh Total Dog can stay up front. This is a little suspicious. Anything hidden here? Nope. But yeah, uh, the last two major games that I uh, beat on stream were Pokemon Yellow and uh, and Stadium, inc which included the Round 2 stuff. So hoping we can do Round 2 stuff and then I'll move on to Gen 3 and do Colosseum and Gale of Darkness and so on and so forth. Gen 3 is when it's really going to get wild between the IVs and the... Uh, and the natures. Here I just have to worry about IV, so if I really care, I just kinda I just catch Pokemon, check their IVs, rinse repeat until I get good IVs. For Gen 3 I'm probably going to uh stream Emerald and then I will uh I'll play like Sapphire and Ruby on the sides. Just to help with the completion of the Pokedex. It's my turn! There's no escape! I agree, there is no escape. For you. How are you giving less EXP than wild Pokemon? That's what's blowing my mind right now. Like, I feel like if I went back... To just to the left of uh, Ekruti. I feel like those Tauros and Miltanks and Meows and all of that would be giving me way more EXP than you're giving me. I fully understand that I'm like super overleveled. But uh, they would still get more EXP than you were giving right now. still put you to sleep, but I'll do this instead. I indeed do have a Discord. The Route 1 battle. Pidgey still wins. I forget if my ra if my Rattata has Super Fang yet. I'll keep running into you until you trip a secret switch. 
Hyper Potion. Won't be using any of those for a while. My other statues everywhere. I'm okay with that. Yeah, sure. Duh. Send me a, a DM here on Twitch with your, uh, your stuff and I'll add you. I'm guessing it's going to be two battles each, then. We had a little more variety, though. It's always like Zubat, Grimer, Rattata. I get that that's like the standard uh, Team Rocket starter pack for Rocket Grunt. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Dang, I failed. My turn, there's no escape. That's right, Soul Silver did have the uh little thing where you were you had to pretend you were a rocket grunt. That's true. Well like hard gold and soul silver, but yeah, that generation had that. I forgot about that. I've already got it planned out because I have a uh, forever ago I bought a Katsukiri 3DS so that I could uh, just hook into the computer and stream so I should be good for every single Pokemon game I intend to play. The Katsukiri 3DS, and I have the I have Loopy's DS uh, mod. So if I really want to, I can just use my uh, regular DS for the DS games, and then hop over to the 3DS. But I'll probably just use the 3DS, just like I did for Assassin's Creed uh, Altair's Chronicles. Like I did forever ago. We'll keep appearing to you. Trip a uh, secret switch. You found a nugget. Oh. We can start duping nuggets if I ever need money now. I think that's the first nugget I've ever found. Guess I'll keep leaving uh, Totodal up front. No, no point in switching him out yet. Hey, intruder alert! thing is i think uh the dimensions for the games are a little off but there's like a way to do it i can't remember right now but when you boot up a ds game i think if you're holding a specific button combo down then it'll give you the original resolution but i don't mind having it be a little bit bigger because the 3ds screen's a little bit bigger i think it still keeps the uh the ratio uh Pittsburgh Penguin, I sent you the uh, friend request. Probably won't be uh, checking Discord in the meantime. Till I'm uh, done with the stream, but I did send you the invite through there. Doo -doo -doo. I played some old games and stretching isn't a huge issue. It's my turn, there's no escape. I think they say the same dialogue every single time. I don't mind the stretching as long as the, the ratio is correct. 
Like technically right now, I'm running it through FPGA emulation, which is why it looks so crisp right now. And I can dial it into if I feel like it. I come into settings, pocket. Like I can, uh, I can go here and I can dial it in, set the position, all of that stuff. If I want to squeeze it a little more, I can. You can see like it moved a little bit there. But I'm, uh, I'm keeping it to more or less the same dimensions I was using with the, uh, the Game Boy Player. I'm not sure if those were accurate, but uh, that's what I was using, so I'm going to keep it. Analog Pocket's crazy expensive, though. I mean, I like that it's basically an all-in-one FPGA system. So, like, they just slowly and steadily people have been migrating Mr. FPGA cores over to it. So you just put an SD card and all your RIP stuff, you can just dump it in there and it'll just work. I doubt that it'll ever have, uh... Well, I guess you could play dual analog stick games if you're using it on the dock. And then hook in a Bluetooth controller that has it with the four shoulder buttons. Alright, we're gonna have to sw swap you out, Totodao. You, you got enough, uh... Enough sunshine. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Surveillance cams are in the Pokemon set. Yeah, they just keep saying the same old, same old. What total dial's evolving? No, he's not. Do 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 do. Guess I'll set up. Send the pull up first. Is that a coughing? Oh, could I catch wild Pokemon in here? Oh, they're level 21! So either I could have gone through, I'm assuming I could have gone through all of the rocket grunts or I could have fought my way through. If I fight my way through, I guess I don't have to deal. Whoa, was that a Voltorb I heard? I don't think I've caught a Voltorb yet, so I'll definitely be catching one. Yeah, we don't have a Voltorb yet. We're, uh, we're catching you, bud. Mareep, I choose you. Guess I'll have another Pokemon to level up now. Thundershock, because there's no way that I think you're gonna kill it. If you, uh... It's gonna be not very effective. Yeah, we could use a couple thunder shocks on it and not have to worry. I love Ampharos. I know it's not the greatest electric type, but I love Ampharos. I know it would probably make more sense to use a, an electrode with like explosion and thunderbolt and whatever else would be useful. That it can learn in Gen 2. I'm actually not sure what it can learn in Gen 2. Well, that was an easy catch. Voltorb, the ball Pokemon. Height 1 foot 8 inches. Weight 23 pounds. During the study of this Pokemon, it was discovered that its components are not found in nature. True. Would maybe be Electabuzz. This I, I'll take my my yellow version Pikachu. I'm not gonna lie. 
I think here it can finally have the uh, the unique Pikachu item. I forget what it's called. Uh... Shoot, I forget what it's called, but I know that it'll be holding it when you trade it over. I mean, it'll still it'll just be a glass cannon at that point. I do want to bring in my yellow version team over. I think that'll be wild. Is that a Geo dude? It's a Geo dude. What's a Geo dude doing in here? What? I'm not gonna fight you. Oh, I can't escape. Oh, I have to defeat you. Way to go, Syndical. Jeez, you monster. Hee <laughs> hee. Feeling lucky, punk? Go ahead, take another step. We've got traps set in the floor. I wonder what other Pokemon are in here. Hold up. We'll probably bring up that uh, Poke map. He's got a lot of Pokemon. Oh, this Pokemon can't tell me what Pokemon are actually in here. Oh, that stinks. To one Pokemon I didn't have, so I was hoping I could uh, just keep catching Pokemon. Do -do 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 -do. Kaboom! I don't even know where the traps are planted, you'll just have to collect your courage and walk. I can look it up. Oh, there could also be a, an electrode in here. Self-destructed. Not that I think it's gonna kill me or anything, but I did. I did not expect that. All right, so we encountered all of the Pokemon that I could potentially catch here. <laughs> I like how he jumped over the thing so he wouldn't have to fight the Pokemon. That's that's a nice little attention to detail. I'm not gonna lie. Wasting a flame wheel with that much help. Syndical is also level 36. 
trying to learn Swift. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of Tackle. I don't even need to think about that. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Dang, I failed. Evolving? I don't think so, buddy. Watch, watch. Oh, he didn't. He came from, from the other way. Send out Chikorita. Nope. We're gonna send out Gasoline. Instead, I should have kept the uh, Fuse Ray. I put him to sleep, then confuse him, then move on to Dream Eater. I feel like that should have been the smarter move. I think I did that with my gold version, Ghastly. I would want uh, Gengar to potentially know. To be fair though. You and your little quick attack. Surveillance cams are in the statues. We'll keep appearing until you trip the switch. Do you trip it again? Nope doesn't trip again. But I see another one that I'm going to be tripping over here. Wait, didn't we already trip this one though? Yeah, we did. We came down through here. This was once a ninja hideout. There are traps to confound... To confound intruders like you. I don't know what happened to me there. You do not look like the scientists from uh, Gen 1. Ooh, Gurp. She still had Cyndaquil in the first slot. Still enough to take you down, though. Oh, that one was not a critical hit. But your supersonic failed, which means my Razor Leaf's gonna finish you off. Haha! <laughs> Are you only going to use Magnemite? Guaranteed 20. Scientist Jed was defeated. I get it. Alright, I'll divulge a secret about our hideout. That thing on the floor up ahead is a warp panel. If you step on it, you'll be warped back to the entrance. 
We found a guard spec. A secret switch, better press it. Switch is turned off. Oh, that must be the switch that they were talking about earlier. Hi, Lance. Are you all right? Your Pokemon are hurt and tired. Here, give them some of my medicine. Lee, let's give it our best for Pokemon. The door is closed. It needs a password to open. You rotten little pest! That HP, uh, Chikorita. So, Total Dial's got a hundred. Grr. Keeps giving me like 720 and 760s. Well, duh. Has to have a password only Team Rocket knows. I saw the letters ESF on the, like, texture for the stairs. Anybody else notice that? I don't know if they'll be visible. Like, without the flashing from the battle starting, but I swear I saw ESF on the steps. No, oh, yeah, it says it. ESF. I don't know if that's intentional or what, but it says ESF. Heh, I'm just a grunt. I don't know the password. Too bad for you. Do you know the password? Heh, only the boss knows the password for that door. Where's the boss? Who knows? Go look for yourself. It takes two passwords to get into the boss's quarters. Those passwords are known only to a few rockets. That rocket there... That rocket there very graciously told me so. Lee, let's go get the passwords. Doo -doo -doo. Erg, The guy in the cape is incredibly tough. He found a full heal. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Female rocket. Lee found ice heal. I used to work for Sylph, but now I run research for Team Rocket. A meddlesome child like you needs to be punished. Pretty high chance for poisoning. That's what I wanted to avoid. more than the smog. Ooh. 
light screen. That depends. Do you have a higher special defense? As a Meganium? You have the exact same amount! The stuff you would be weak to, generally speaking, to would be special though, so I guess I'll roll with the light screen. What Chikorita's evolving? Wait a minute. Interesting. I'm gonna have to breed a her chikorita later so that I can learn leech seed. I'd wanted to know leech seed. Do I know the password? Maybe. But no weakling's gonna get it. I got looks just like Jesse, basically. Not Jesse, uh what's her face? All oh, this battle's happening, let me see if I can look them up. Cassidy or Yamato if you're watching it in Japanese. Alright, stop, I'll tell you. The password to the boss's room is Slowpoke Tail. But it's useless unless you have two passwords. Stupid freaking poison. I'm a cheapskate and I don't plan on using my items. instinctively stepped on that teleporter I would have been so upset
I don't care that Pokemon are hurt by our experiments. Aren't you a jerk? You've got a ditto. Oh, that was not enough to take it down. I really thought it was. Take that, scientist Mitch. Thinking is my strong suit, not battling. He had a lot of money. If we turn up the power of our radio signal for broadcast nationwide, the very thought excites me. Aren't you a jerk? Yuck, yuck, yuck! You're challenging me to a battle? Huh, you're nuts, but you have guts. I like that. If you can beat me, I'll tell you a password to the bosses. Why? Why would you do that? Like... Strategically speaking, why would you do that? You gotta eradicate. Well, I'm gonna eradicate your eradicate. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Yuck, yuck, yuck. You're good. Yuck, yuck, yuck. The password to the boss's room? Uh, I think it's Radicate Tail. Oh my god. You found an X special. You found a protein. anything else for me to explore here wait there's these steps oh a kid i don't really like this but eliminate but eliminate you i must Using Pokemon for evil. That's no good. See why you were leaving your uh, Zubat for last. Not exactly the best type matchup for you. Rocket Grunt was defeated. I knew I'd lose. Didn't I tell you that I was going to destroy Team Rocket? Tell me, who was the guy in the cape who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. It's what he said that bothers me. 
He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. Hm. I don't have the time for the likes of you. What the? What was that interaction? He shows up out of nowhere just to like complain that he lost? What is wrong with him? TM46. What's TM46? I think I went right past my TM uh, pocket. Thief! An attack that may steal a held item. What? Well, who are you? This is the office of our leader, Giovanni. Since disbanding Team Rocket three years ago, he has been tra in training, but we're certain he'll be back. Someday to assume command again. That's why we're standing guard. I won't let anyone disturb this place. Rocket Executive wants to battle. It sent out a Zubat. Man, you're like... Okay. I think I would rather have this set up like that, yeah. Ooh, so close. Oh, well, that's definitely going to get us to 36. Perfect for Ghastly. Oh, well, that missed. You're not going to poison me. I'm a poison type. Oh, that missed again. And it missed again. And it missed again. How many misses in a row? That's five misses in a row. Come on, game. He did not. He really did not want to go to sleep. I I couldn't do a thing. Giovanni, please forgive me. What Mareep's evolving? You already know you're not evolving. Calm down, Mareep. No, I can't let this affect me. I have to inform the others. There's a Pokemon there, so before I do anything. Murkrow. The password is Hail Giovanni.
I guess I faced off everyone I need to face off. Hold it right there. We can't have a brat like you on the loose. It's harmful to Team Rocket's pride, you see. However strong you may be, you can't take both of us at the same time. Sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. Hey, don't be so selfish. Spread the fun around. What? You had an accomplice? Where is your sense of honor? As the interim boss in place of Giovanni, I'll show you how wrong it is to meddle with Team Rocket. That guy has a Dragonite. <laughs> You're not winning. Rocket Executive wants to battle. They sent out Arbok. Well, that's fine. We got a Ghastly. Who we'll may or may not put them to sleep. Okay, it did put them to sleep. Yeah, for real, they were about to jump me. They're talking about honor. Honestly, though, I would have taken them both on. I'm sure my Pokemon would have been able to slap them silly. And they're not even evolved. Look at you. Look at you. You're in your little Arbok. Didn't stand a chance against this Ghastly. Ooh, Murkrow. I have not seen a Murkrow yet in game. That's gonna hurt. So hopefully we can put you to sleep. You had that same type attack bonus times two, basically. It doesn't affect Merc. Psychic doesn't affect Dark types, that's right. That's okay, we can Nightshade you instead. Ghastly grew to level 36. Ghastly's trying to learn Destiny Bond. This is where it gets rough. Because I do want Destiny Bond. I think most Gengar builds are going to require that I have Destiny Bond. But Destiny Bond is really a last resort kind of deal. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna finally have to get rid of Lick. I should be able to outspeed everything. God, this stinks! Because Nightshade's my only real, like, ghost attack, which is static to my level anyway. Dream Eater's the only other, like, uh, damaging move I have for now. And Lick is great for paralyzing. But it does little damage. I already have a status effect move, it's just not very useful. It might have to be Lick. I'm just trying to weigh my options here. Yeah, I think it's finally time to say goodbye to Lick. Gotta rearrange my moves now, though. And leave them out just so I can rearrange it. 
definitely do not want Destiny Bond to be the first move. Oh no! It put me to sleep instead! That's two turns that I'm asleep. That's three turns that I'm asleep. Now it's your turn to be asleep. Rocket Executive was defeated. <laughs> you really are strong. It's too bad. If you were to join Team Rocket, you could become an executive. We got 1800 for winning. And what Ghastly's trying to evolve? Not today, mister. This hideout is done for, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself all you can. <laughs> that did it. We defeated all the rockets here, but I'm concerned about the young guy I battled in the process. Sorry, Lee. I saw how well you were doing, so I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is to turn off that odd radio signal. It's this machine that's causing all the problems. I don't see a switch on it. We have no choice. We have to make all the electrode faint. That should stop this machine from transmitting that strange signal. It's no fault of the Pokemon, so it makes me feel guilty. Lee, let's split the job. I didn't touch the status move until Sun and Moon leave the game. Alright, this is the part where I'm kind of dumb. I say I'm kind of dumb at this part because he said we have to make him faint, and that's the last thing I do. I'm not letting you do that to yourself, Bucky. I wanted to say Buckaroo and I said Bucky instead. I tried to self-destruct. I'm not letting it self-destruct. At level 23, it's already fast. It's still faster than me. Electrode speed is crazy. Given a home in my PC box, which is better than getting knocked out. Electro, the ball Pokemon, 3 feet 11 inches at 147 pounds. The more energy it charges up, the faster it gets. But this also makes it more likely to explode.
He's over there like, oh my god, I feel so bad. I have to knock out all these electrode and here I am catching them instead. See how much damage Slash does. Oh, well that's actually kind of perfect. Don't do that, because if you self-destruct, that's going to be no good for you. Maybe we can uh, get Ghastly out to sleep him before. Such a status move until sun and moon came out. <laughs> hey man, there, I knew tons of people, myself included. Like, your Pokemon's trying to learn a move that doesn't do any that. Nope. I think that's a meme and everything. Second electrode was caught. a critical hit. Gotcha, Electrode was caught. That odd signal has finally stopped. The lake should be back to normal. You're the hero. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I do not have but I don't have a need for it. Lee received HMO6. What's what's that? Whirlpool, teach it to a Pokemon to get across wild water. But keep this in mind, you can use that out of battle only with the badge from Mahogany. Lee. The journey to becoming the Pokemon Master is long and difficult. Knowing that, will you keep going? I see. No, you're right. If you would give up that easily, you would have never chased that dream in the first place. I look forward to seeing you again. You really knock out all the electrodes, dude. You couldn't, couldn't catch them. No, you're a dragon trainer. You could have caught them, given it to some kid. Actually, take that back. The kid doesn't know what they're doing. That electrode's gonna go boom. Could have been given a home somewhere else, Lance. Oh, I thought because we had completed all of this, we were good. I was wrong. <laughs> So we'll take the teleporter out. Oh, I'll always play that music then. Is the Rage Candy Bar guy still here? I'm packing up. Don't bother me, kiddo. What was this, Jim? 
Mahogany Town Pokemon Gym. Price is a veteran who trained Pokemon for 50 years. He's said to be a god at freezing opponents with ice type moves. That means you should melt him with your burning ambition. Pokemon sizes are so funny. Yeah, they are. I remember watching the anime. I legitimately thought Charizards and Blastoids and Venusaurs were so big because of that one episode after the same and like sunk. Some fire pokes with me. Chikorita, you would get blasted in there. You are not coming in. Full picks, on the other hand, should be able to handle yourself. I gotta find my uh, Growlithe. Why are you in this box? Oh, you should be in box four with all the other Pokemon I actually enjoy. of this Corsola in there. Pidgey, you would also get decimated in there, so you're out. Miltank PTSD. And because I was so overleveled, I had no concerns. And that was part of the plan. <laughs> I'll freeze your Pokemon so you can't do a thing. But <laughs> what? Border Ronald? Hey, now that's a water ice Pokemon. That's kind of not cool. Might just break even here. Not even close because it's a water type. Oh! I didn't want to use Flame Wheel again. Fight! Dugo Okay. This is why Mareep's here. Oh, I should have probably healed. That's a lot of EXP. defeated. Darn, I couldn't do a thing. Let me actually heal up. And over half the stream was just us doing stuff at the Lake of Rage in Mahogany Town. Check 
out my parallel turn. Are you uh, gonna be a skier? Oh, I was right. Skier Clarissa, and she only has one Pokemon, and it's a Dugong! What's with all the water types? I thought this was an ice gym! just used rest like it really just used rest oh my god bite it's not very effective here in terms of raw damage output so I'm better off using takedown also doesn't help that it keeps roaring Please don't drag out this fight. Oh my god. It's really gonna drag out this fight. This is me being stubborn, because I know I could just switch over to Mareep again and just end. Oh my god, it missed. Mareep could just end this fight in an instant. Yeah, I'm switching out to Mareep. No, forget you. I'm not- I'm not doing this game. Actually, let's make it funnier. You wanna take a nap? Go ahead, take a nap. Take all the naps you want. This gym has a slippery floor. It's fun, isn't it? But hey, we're not playing games here. It was rigged from the start, yeah? I swear the entire gym's just gonna be like seals and dugongs apparently. Oh, we finally got an ice type. Sorry, Brad. It's just not happening. Do you see how serious we are? Totally. I know Price is secrets. Okay. I mean, you're uh, gonna divulge it to me. Order Douglas. Another water type. What is this? I should have just brought Chikorita. And it's like high defense water types, too. I like how I said that, and Growlithe just took a bite out of crime. Ho ho ho, this is me being brave right now. Or incredibly stupid.
Did way more damage than I was going to give it credit for, but it worked. Water type gets defeated by fire type. Rolifs now level 36. Okay, I'll tell you Price's secret. I'm just gonna give out people's secrets. The secret behind Price's power, he meditates under a waterfall daily to strengthen his body and mind. Okay, that wasn't necessarily useful for uh, feeding anyone, but thanks. To get the price our gym leader, you need to think before you skate. Oh, she's only got one Pokemon. And it's Jinx! Pulpix already knows Flamethrower. I wouldn't lose to you in skiing. Yeah, but this isn't a skiing game. This is a Pokemon game, lady. Let's get healed up before we decide to go any further. to check something out real quick guys I'll be right back I heard something fall want to make sure my dog didn't just knock something over Alright, I'm back. And the, uh, dog did knock something over. <laughs> Thankfully, it was, uh, nothing too serious. So I'm gonna assume... I wanna keep going around in a circle, I guess.
That's not it. Kind of bigger, okay. Better, I think. I know we've been able to get here before because I fought him already. We end up in front of him. Can't go left, can't go down. I can only go right. Go down from here. Okay. There we go. I knew it was gonna have to be with like trying to end up behind those two Pokeball statues. Pokemon have many experiences in their lives, just like we do. I, too, have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I am your elder, let me show you what I mean. I have been with Pokemon since before you were born. I do not lose easily. I, Price, the Winter Trainer, shall demonstrate my power. Leader Price wants to battle. Leader Price sent out, of course, it's a seal. attack be more effective in damaging it a little bit of course it's a dugong I am Mareep since he's gonna be using Gen 1 water types in place. I know that they're part ice, doesn't matter. And he's paralyzed. He is using ice attacks at least.
Then I guess that's the Evolve Hornus Swine on. You little swine. In Pittsburgh, this is the... This is the Pokemon that needed to be out when you said the Piggy comment. Leader Price was defeated. Ah, I'm impressed by your prowess. With your strong will, I know you will overcome all life's obstacles. You are worthy of this badge. Lee got 3,100 for winning and sent some home to mom. Lee received the Glacier Badge. That badge will raise the special stat of Pokemon. It also lets you lets your Pokemon use Whirlpool to get across real Whirlpools. And this this is a gift from me. We received TM16. Icy Wind. It inflicts damage and lowers speed. It demonstrates the harshness of winter. When the ice and snow melt, spring arrives. You and your Pokemon will be together for many years to come. Cherish your time together. Price is something. But you're something else. That was a hot battle that bridged the generation the generation gap. Did I read that correctly? Could have been generational gap, I guess. Professor Elm. Lee, how are things going? I called because something weird is happening with the radio broadcast. They were talking about Team Rocket. Lee, do you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned? No, that just can't be true. Sorry to bug you, take care. Buena's password. Ahem, we are Team Rocket. After three years of preparation, we have a, we have risen again from the ashes. Giovanni, can you hear? We did it! Where is our boss? Is he listening? Ahem. We are Team Rocket. Lucky channel. So it's just gonna keep saying the same thing. Pokemon music. Oaks Pokemon talk. Coming over the radio, it must be in Goldenrod City. some water. That's the true gamer drink. I don't care what anyone says. I love me drinking some water. Wait, could I have... 
I want I forgot that I wanted to see if I could go from mahogany. Oh yeah, the guy's gone. The burnt berry. Are you a trick? Yeah, you are. I'm gonna win for sure. We can keep going out this way. Psychic will. Will? No, Phil. I like how gold and silver Pidgey is like pink instead of that yellow texture. Adabara. That's a shocking loss. Hello, Mom. Hi, Lee. How are you? I found a useful item shopping, so I bought it with your money. Sorry, it's in your PC. You'll like it. I have to also deposit stuff in the PC. Oh, wait, right. Let's check this route. Is there anything we can catch while we're here? Apparently we can catch Licky Tongue out in the grass here, then everything else we can already get. I fish until I can't anymore. I also battle until I drop. That's my relationship with my Pokemon. There's a 40% chance of catching a Licky Tongue out here. Which is uh, the only real unique Pokemon that I think we can get out here. Way to go, Pidgey. This isn't right. That's 100 wins and 101 losses. I won't battle again for a while. From all the way on the edge of the screen, you look strong. This should be a good fight. Just kidding. Good trainers seek tough opponents instinctively. smokes of Butterfree. I don't see those out here very often. Did you grew to level 36? Ooh. First Blossom we see ever, I think.
It survived! That's wild! Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> that was not a fire type. Full trainer Sybil. Nope, this won't do at all. What Pidgey's evolving? No, it's not. You guys know you can't evolve. Not yet. We all get better by experiencing many battles. I battled a lot too. To become what I am today, an elite. Do 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 do. Pretty soon I'm gonna have to pop the game out and uh there's a time thing. So I don't mess up my uh mystery gift stuff. I wish I could do it through here, but the analog pockets shortcuts kind of mess with it. Is there an upper path we can take? Yes, there is. Ack! You made me lose a polywag. What are you going to do about it? for uh, Chikorita, so let's send out Chikorita. Oh, we missed. No es bueno. Just gotta watch out for those packs. Fisher Wilton was defeated. Just forget about it. That polywag that got away. It was huge. I swear it must have been 16... Really? Eh, our battle was fun, I'd say. When I'm fishing, I sometimes snag items that people have dropped. Do you want them? What's the number? Oh, well, we're getting rid of another number out of my Poke gear. If you're gonna give me free items... We're gonna get rid of Alan. Give me your number. I will gladly take free items. I'll do anything to get my hands on rare Pokemon. I know there's gonna be a Poke Nerd or whatever they're called. Pokemaniac. Rhyhorn! I still have a Pidgey.
We found Ultra Ball. I can tell you're a good trainer by looking at you. I'm good at Pokemon. I can see that you are too. Full trainer Alan wants to battle. Ooh, Charmeleon. a crit. That's the only reason. Full Trainer Allen was defeated. <laughs> it's a total loss on my part. Wow, you have a lot of badges. No wonder you're so tough. I wonder if Ecritique's gym leader Morty is still in training. He really hammered me. How many badges does that make? We're like up to seven now, right? Seven badges, yeah. We're almost there. Do you know about the legendary bird Pokemon? I do. But they're not in this game, because presumably Red, or me, in the past has already caught them. They're waiting to be traded over. Oh man. Your Pidgeotto versus my Pidgey. Who's gonna win? battle. Marie grew to level 37 and is trying to learn THUNDER. This guy went straight from Thundershock to Thunder. Well... I would have rather learned Thunderbolt, but what can you do? Phew, you're hot stuff! What, Mareep's evolving? Let me see something. Did I close it out? I must have closed it out. Alright, Mareep is on their way to evolving, because that was the last of the moves that they needed to learn. Well, Pidgey. Oh, Pidgey's got all the way to level 47 to go. Total Dial's got uh, 52. Wow! 52's when it learns Hydro Pump. It learns no other water techniques until then. What? about Cinder Quill? It'll learn Flamethrower at 46. Guess we'll ask for Chikorita next. Solar Beam at 50. That's painful. What about Ghastly? I think Ghastly might have learned the last of their moves. Yeah, 36. Destiny Bond. Ooh. 
we're getting there. Pretty soon most of the team's gonna start evolving. And by next stream, some of them might already be evolved. Who knows? Ice path ahead. Ice path. At night I can catch a deli bird. Right now I can catch a swine up. LOL, what the heck am I doing? I'm trying to see if I can find any items here in the ice, but I guess not. HM07? What the heck is HM07? Waterfall. An aquatic charge attack. Wait, it was a charge attack back then? Stop asking for, like, location data, Google. ADBP Are there any wild Pokemon here? I've not been attacked. I want to get that item. Oh, there we go. We finally got attacked. Of course, it's a gold bot. <laughs> Bat has a 60% chance of showing up and Swinub has a 40% chance. Oh, well there's a Swinub. I'm gonna pass on this one because it's female and females have less attack. I think we were just working our way through this whole cave, and now is when I start getting attacked. That's another female. I 
I'm gonna say that every single stream, I hate that they made it so that female Pokemon were generally speaking weaker in terms of physical attacks in this game. Because there's some Pokemon that I would rather have as female. But unless they are gonna be special attack focused, it is not wise to use female Pokemon in Gen 2, from what I understand. Also, I don't know how to get that item. Now this one we can catch, and then I will soft reset for all eternity later. keep using Endor because I would not want to accidentally KO you, but at least like to get your Pokedex data. Basement floor 1, we can get Sneasel at 1% if we come at night. Doesn't affect so It's a ground type. And also catch a Jinx at 1% in the basement floor. There's a couple Pokemon I can catch here that I don't have Dex data on. Sneasel is going to have to be at night, so is Delibird. Swinub, the pig Pokemon, 1 foot 4 inches, 14 pounds, it uses the tip of its nose to dig for food. Its nose is so tough that even frozen ground poses no problem. explore this area. I already see that I need strength to be in here. I wish that I would have known that before traveling halfway into the cave game. I don't have any Pokemon that I don't care about wasting a move slot for. Carbos, at least. Every time I see it, just like a random spot, I always think to check. And a max potion. Can't solve this without strength.
I think I got an idea. Because I'm going to be needing a Pokemon that could just kind of do everything. I don't know if I could still catch one out here, but... I can't do it right now. I don't have Surf. This is what I'm talking about! Cool for now. Their stats aren't going to even be important. I don't know if this will work or if I can even still get one. To carp or biting, that doesn't sound good. Carp. chance. There we go. need to put him to sleep now. And hypnosis never connects. Oh my gosh. Hypnosis, come on. Yes. 
All right, I gotta differentiate him from my actual Gyarados, because he's probably gonna have terrible stats. So your name's gonna be... Wave Runner. Let's get the heck out of here. Wait, can I just fly from here? Do I have to be on land to use fly? I guess not. I always keep thinking to deposit, but I don't want to deposit. Moving Pokemon is so much more convenient. Only bad thing is that it saves right after. So let me grab Wave Runner. Actually, while I'm here, because I know I'll keep forgetting. All these items I picked up that would quickly fill up my bag. Might as well put these away too. You know, these are the most annoying and common ones, so I'll keep these. Now Wave Runner or Surf. I believe they can also learn strength. And they should also be able to learn Whirlpool. Is the only move it knew was Thrash? Now I have a Pokemon that can do all of the silly water things. I don't need Jigglypuff here anymore. I gotta do the reset time thing. Uh, still have it open, right? I do not. There we go.
I need to know how much money I have. Alright, so that'll give me the password. We'll save for a moment. I'll quit the cartridge. Let me go pull that out. And then we'll pop it into the Game Boy I have here, and we'll reset it. I wish I could just do it from the analog pocket. I wonder if there's a way to disable or change the uh, inputs for that. Reset the clock, yes. And our code is... Password is okay. I just need to, well, I don't need to, but I always like to align it to the actual world clock. I goofed. I forgot that I'm, the whole point of this is for me to put it into PM. I put it to AM again. Brilliant! We just gotta wait another minute or so. About, oh, I wanna say another 20 seconds now. Ten seconds now. Now we'll save. Now I'll just pop this back into the analog pocket. We can continue where we left off. I guess we'll uh, check out the radio station. I guess we'll call it kind of quits, maybe. Oh, what's this? Pokemon, they're nothing more than tools for making money. Are they going to block off most of the major stuff? Is that what's going on here? Stay out of the way. Beat it. Our dream will soon come true. It was such a long struggle. Are they really blocking people off in their homes? Hey, Brett. You don't belong here. Get lost. Come taste the true terror of Team Rocket. Take over the radio tower. What? It's none of your business. So this is the radio tower. What do you want, you pest? Scram. Hello, I'm sorry, but we're not offering any tours today. You be so calm, lady. We've finally taken over the radio tower. Now everyone will get to experience the true terror of Team Rocket. 
We'll show you how scary we are. Rocket Grunt would like to battle and sends out Eradicate. by just the teeniest, tiniest sliver. I hate when they use quick attack because it just draw drags out the battle. Agility? <laughs> no. Too strong, we must watch you. What Pidgey's evolving? No, he's not. they want to take over the radio tower. Why not, huh? Today's password? Help, of course! Ha 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 ha! How boring! It was far too easy to take over this place. Come on, keep me amused. Imagine leering and having it fail. Who, who are you? We're Team Rocket, the exploiters of Pokemon. We love being evil. Scared? No, I've smacked you guys around enough times to not really be that afraid of you, to be honest. Tata. a quick attack. Man, you just had a, almost a full team. Rocket Grunt was defeated. You think you're a hero? Hey, hey, keep out of our way. 
wondering if I should raise all of my Pokemon across this week to 37 or 40. I give up. That guy's like da -da 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 -da. three years ago, Team Rocket was forced to disband, but we're making a comeback here. So you claim. Oh, Grimer. Gonna keep slashing my problems away. I had mentally like checked out for a second, I was like, oh clearly I've leveled up. Fights are not as good, but I mean, he flinched. Oh, he's sending out a muck, huh? Sounds like it's your time to shine, Ghastly. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Wah, well, don't get cute. Photodile's evolving. Nope. Soon. We're getting there, Totodile. We're getting there. We won't let you ruin our plans for our comeback. Our executives are trying to take this place over. They have some big plan. I wonder what that is. We're not always evil. We just do whatever we like. You beat me and I won't forget it. The trainers, Pokemon, are their beloved partners. It's terrible how Team Rocket is trying to control Pokemon. I've been given strict orders. I'm to crush anyone who challenges Team Rocket. It looks like a scientist down there. I'm sure he's working for Team Rocket. Popping! I'm just leveling right now. 
I meant to pick Flame Wheel there, but uh, Swift did the trick. They got 920 for winning since home to mom. Feels great ordering Pokemon to commit crimes. Ooh, it's a wheezing. leveled up. You're kidding. Yep, I knew it. An unknown child wandering here. Who are you? All right, scientist Mark. to use another Magnemite. Uh, and I guess I'll send out Chikorita. Not the best choice, but it is a choice. It's not very effective. I'll have 80 HP after this. It always does 20. Cuckoo, cuckoo. Is confused no more. I took you too lightly. What Cyndaquil's evolving? No, thank you. It's the card key slot. Team Rocket Boss has locked himself in, but the director can open it. He's up on the fifth floor. Please save him. Come 
Most excellent. This radio tower will fulfill our grand design. Porygon? Oops, we're supposed to swap out Cyndaquil. Plans come with a snag. You plan to rescue the director? That won't be possible because I'm going to beat you. Dead instead of body slam, and oh god, it knows leech life. First paralysis I've ever seen while using body slam with Chikorita. Alright, it's Gasly's turn to level up now. If hypnosis ever connects, that is. That's two hypnosis that then connect in a row. Unbelievable. What Chikorita's evolving? You, you, you came to rescue me? Is that what you were expecting? Wrong, I'm an imposter. I pretended to be the real thing to prepare for our takeover. Do you want to know where we hit the real director? Sure, I'll tell you, but only if you can beat me. Really? Why? Even if I did beat you, why would you tell me? Oh, he's actually going to be tough. All of his Pokemon are probably going to be 30 or so, huh?
Oh my god, it's just gonna be a team of coughing, isn't it? Finally, something different. for that though. Oh my gosh. Okay. It was a team of nothing but coughing and one wheezing, and it dragged out so long. Okay, okay, I'll tell you where he is. What ghastly is evolving? Not yet. He'll be evolving soon enough, don't worry, ghastly. We stashed the real director in the underground warehouse. It's at the far end of the underground. But I doubt you'll get that far. Lee received basement key. underground. We fought everyone down here. Ah, jokes on you, I could get around to you.
Kylie, do us a favor and take this Eevee. It came over when I was adjusting the time capsule. Someone has to take care of it, but I don't like being outside. Can I count on you to play with it, Lee? Yes, I knew you would come through. Way to go, you're the real deal. Okay, I'm counting on you. Take care, care of it. Whoa, wait, you can't carry any more Pokemon. Well, I guess I'll be soft resetting for an Eevee as well this week. Can't use the bike here. But we'll have an Eevee too. I call the parallel of Celadon City is also where we get the uh, Eevee. Oh boy. Hold it! I saw you, so I tailed you. I don't need you... I don't need you underfoot while I take care of Team Rocket. Wait a second. You beat me before, didn't you? That was just a fluke. But I repay my debts. Oh my gosh. Listen, man. Why are we battling each other? We're supposed... Like, why don't we work together instead to... Try and save this director. You are always showing up at the most inopportune times. It is wild to me that we're battling. Soon I will have a Haunter as well. If not a Gengar. Magnemite's your weakest Pokemon I've seen so far. In terms of levels, at least. Oh, you're at your third stage already, huh? a critical hit, otherwise I'm pretty sure you would have been able to tank it. Cyndaquil grew to level 38. Why? Why do I lose? I've assembled the toughest Pokemon. I didn't ease up on the gas. So why do I lose? Oh, uh, what's his face? Lance already told you why you're not doing too hot, buddy. Not that hard to figure out. I don't understand. Is is what that Lance guy said true? That I don't treat Pokemon properly? Love? Trust? Are they keeping me from winning? I... I just don't understand. But it's not going to end here. 
Not now. Not because of this. I won't give up my dream of becoming the world's best Pokemon trainer. W weren't you gonna defeat Team Rocket? Like, why are you running away? Useless. I don't care if you're lost. You show up here, you're nothing but a victim. Gonna be the world's strongest for that. Never mind. Yeah, you think you're cool, huh? I'm pretty, pretty cool, actually. It's labeled Switch 1. It's off. Turn it on? Nope. Open one shutter, another closes. Bet you can't get where you want. Oh my god, it's another puzzle. connect That was a crit. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Ghastly's evolving. Found the full heal. Confused too, the switch on the end is the one to press first, but they ditched this project before they finished. I'm searching for leftover loot. You're gonna be a thief. Burglar Eddie.
Oh yeah, that's right, you know Thunder now, whoops. Burglar Eddie was defeated. Over the top. What Pidgey is evolving? Wahaha, confounded by the shutters, are we? I'll let you in on a secret if you can beat me. again. This is why I hate Thunder and why I always go for Thunderbolt. Three misses! Finish me off. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Oof, I blew it. Alright, a hint. Change the order of switching. That'll change the ways the shutters open and close. Lab Pokeball technology apparently gets better in the future. And I say that because I think in the later games they get rid of the whole, like, as you walk around the poison does damage. What do you want to go there for? There's nothing down there.
Oh my god. You must have ice in your veins to this team rocket. Fork over your goodies. set up for Totodile. Mercy! Are you lost? No, you can't be. You don't have that scared look. I'll give you something to be scared about. Rocket Grunt was defeated. How could you? Go wherever you'd like. Get lost. See if I care.
Oh my god. I'm gonna end up looking up a guide for this, because this is stupid. I don't want to be here for all eternity trying to figure this out. Smoke ball. What does that do? Escape from wild Pokemon. Are you kidding me? I don't know what the heck that did. You're not going any far farther. I don't show mercy to my enemies, not even brats. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I remember you. You got me good at our hideout. Oh my god, it's this guy again. Bad grunts don't have names.
keep forgetting to swap out Mareep. gonna hurt. Especially since it was a freaking crit. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I knew it. So that's how. How did you get this far? I guess it can't be helped. I'll dispose of you. Oh my god, I keep forgetting to swap. Take a bath coughing. I got disposed of. PM thirty five. Sleep talk. That's useful. Who? What? You came to rescue me. <laughs> Thank you. The radio tower. What's happening there? Taken over by Team Rocket. Here, take this card key. Use that to open the shutters on the third floor. I'm begging you to help. There's no telling what they'll do if they control the transmitter. They may even be able to control Pokemon using a special signal. You're the only one I can call on. Please save the radio tower and all the Pokemon nationwide. Amulet coin. Hey kid, you're holding us up. Our policy is to work behind the scenes where no one can see us.
Doop, 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 doop. Blue, 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 doop, boo. Wait, what am I doing? I'm supposed to go to the radio tower. I know I said radio tower and I go into every other building but the radio tower. Why did the shutter open? Did you have something to do with this? I got scared I was going to get poisoned for a second. Glad I didn't. I'm done for! What? You made it past our men in the underground. How could you? Uh... Like... What thing? I don't know. Four Floor Studio 2. Stop! I'm known as the Team Rocket Fortress. You're not taking another step. Oh, he's fast. And you know Confused Ray. Fortress came down. What total dolls evolving? Nope. No, he is not. Don't think. Don't I think Pokemon are cute? I'll think my Pokemon are cute. After they beat yours.
Please be paralyzed. Don't attack. Fog. I have not had a single type advantage throughout this fight. Like anything that Razor... Like, I can't use Razor Leaf. I have to keep body slamming to victory. Oh no, they're so useless. That's mean. Mary, why? Why do I have to suffer through this? Meow, yeah, help me. Remember me from the hideout in Mahogany Town? I lost then, but I won't this time. Rocket Executive wants the battle. Oh, was a crit. And we're paralyzed. Could have sent out a uh, Cyndaquil. I want to give Pidgey a chance. And there goes her team. This can't be happening. I fought hard, but I still lost. Oh, you managed to get this far. You must be quite the trainer. We intend to take over this radio station and announce our comeback. That should bring our boss Giovanni back from his solo training. We're going to regain our former glory. I won't allow you to interfere with our plans. This is not a good matchup. I'll let Ghastly handle this.
Oh, that missed. Oh, go for it. I dare you. No, forgive me, Giovanni. How could this be? Our dreams have come to naught. I wasn't up to the task after all, like Giovanni did before me. I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. Lee, thank you. Your courageous actions saved Pokemon nationwide. I know it's not much, but please take this. Clear bell. There used to be a tower right here in Goldenrod City, but it was old and creaky, so we replaced it with the radio tower. We dug up that bell during construction. I heard that all sorts of Pokemon live in Goldenrod in the past. Perhaps that bell has some connection to the Tin Tower in Ecruteague City. Ah, that reminds me. I overheard Team Rocket whispering. Apparently something is going on at the Tin Tower. I have no idea what is happening, but you might want to look into it. Okay, I better go to my office. Yo, 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 this is DJ Leak. Is this a random Ultra Ball here? Oh, you're my little savior. Will you take this as my thanks? They received the pink bow. It's just... It's just for... It's just right for Pokemon that know normal type moves. Thank you, you're my hero. This is a token of my appreciation. Oh my gosh, everyone's just giving me stuff. Lee put TM11 in the pocket. It's sunny day. Powers up fire type moves for a while. We have recordings of the cries of all the Pokemon that have been found. We must have about 200 kinds. We run 24 hours a day to broadcast entertaining programs. I'll do my best to run around the clock too. I listened to the radio while I was at the ruins. I heard a strange broadcast there. Hello, Lee. You know I love Pokemon. I built this radio tower so I could express my love of Pokemon. It would be nice if people enjoyed our programs. Feel free to look around anywhere. The director is nice again, just as he was before. You can listen to the radio anywhere. Tune in. You can cash in your save points for a lovely price of your choice. Tune in to Password every night from 6 to midnight. Tune in, then drop in for a visit. Lullabies on the radio make my Pokemon sleep. I love Mary from Pokemon Talk. Oh man. What a stream. I'm ready to check out. It is 1 a.m. for me. And I'm just a teeny tiny bit exhausted. But we, once again, did a lot on this stream. So, that's always good. 
I guess next time we'll do some explorations before we uh, head to any other location. Is we have the means of exploring now. A lot of areas. So let's go ahead and do our socials. So if you guys want to know what I'm about to stream, go ahead and give me a follow over at twitter.com slash Lee Mustang, where I'll usually post right before I start streaming. And of course, if you want to see what I'm adding to my game collection over time, feel free to give me a follow over at instagram.com slash Lee.Mustang. You'll see plenty of uh, stuff that I've added to my game collection over time over there. And of course, right, if you want to see the previous parts of this Let's Play, or rather this long play, other Let's Plays, reviews, and all sorts of other videos by me, give me a follow over at youtube.com slash Lee Mustang. And if you happen to be watching this at youtube.com slash Lee Mustang, please let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Subscribe to my channel to help it grow. Click the little bell icon to be in the know. And I will see you guys in the next part. Until then, guys, take care.